Yo, what is up guys, welcome back to another video. So today we're actually playing Skyblock. I, I don't know about you guys, but I've been playing Skyblock a lot recently. Um, so anyways, today we're going to be learning how to, I'm going to be teaching you how to make a crystallized iron AFK farm, or just like an iron AFK farm. So first off, you're going to want to get some iron totems. So I got my iron totems, I have 37, you, you don't need 37. Um, you only need, I don't know how many you need, but um, you just need kind of a flat space here. And so, um, first off, you just want to place a block in the middle here, okay? And then you want to do it like this, just, just follow what I do, okay? So, a 5 by 5 around and make sure it's one block above everything else. And then you just want to place iron totems all along here. Now, if you really want to, you can actually go like this. This will make it even more efficient. And have it like this. This is a little overkill because it uses a lot of iron totems. But if you don't have a lot of iron totems, you can just go like this and just, just do like this, this first square here. Um, but you don't you don't want to mine the iron You are it you're, you're gonna have to wait a bit because you want all these totems to have to fill up fully with iron Like they all have to be full of iron For um for this video. I'm not gonna do this part. I'm just gonna break this So you want to oh that's bad Cause This is hey, You don't want that Okay, so I'm finished breaking that, and the reason I'm only doing this one little part is because I just think it's easier, it's just kind of less complicated, um, in my opinion. But then you want to make a little thing like this. This is like basically your AFK booth, I, I call it. So we just want to test, I know you shouldn't break it yet, but I just want to test. Okay, so you can break the iron tub, you don't want to be able to break that iron tub. So just move it back. So from this block, it is five blocks away, and from right here it says four. So we can still break it. Um, actually, honestly, you don't need it that far because you can just kind of go on an angle and you'll still be able to hit the iron node. So this is a little far. I'll just go like I'll just go like this. So as I said, we want to wait for all of these to fill. It might take a bit. I mean, it's not taking won't take too long but um, I will be back when all of these tomes are full okay so we're back um, so the iron tomes are all full and um, one way to tell is because there's this node is not going away it's just staying there um, so now you want to download this program called tiny task I'm not going to show you how to download there's um watch out because there are, there can be a virus and if you download it from certain websites so just search up a video on how to download it and you'll um, you'll find it so you just want to open it up and then uh, you want to go to preferences and then make sure continuous play like play back is unchecked so you just want to close it like that actually um for preferences again and then um make sure your hoarding hotkey is f8 and your playback Playback hotkey is this control option P. Um, so then you want to get your pickaxe out, go right here, and you guys try not to move your mouse at all because it kind of messes up. So then you want to click F8, you want to mine, and click F8 again. Okay, so we recorded our movement or our hotkey or whatever. And we're gonna wait for the iron to replenish. So it just replenished. And then you wanna click Control Alt Shift P and just let it do its thing. That is pretty much it. So it just keeps going over and over again. Um, as you can see it just it just mines it. It is super duper easy. Um, it does take a bit sometimes, but yeah, this is really all. If you guys want to see more Skyblock videos like this, be sure to like and subscribe. And that will be all. See you guys later. Oh, I forgot. Before I go, 
make sure you join my group black hole close bye